I'm going to show you how to set up this printer for the first time. To set this printer up, you need to first of all press the Wi-Fi and the cancel button together to put this printer in a wireless mode. And when, when you do this, the printer will start to flash. You can see the on button is flashing, okay? Just for three seconds, then you, re you release. And you see the, the on button is flashing now, okay? Now, the next thing we need to do is we need to go to HP Smart App. HP Smart App, download it on your computer. Okay, so this HP Smart App is already downloaded on my computer. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to select Add. Okay, select Add a printer. Uh, by the side, you select Add slash set up a printer. Okay, and it will start to look for available printer. Here we go. So if it found the printer, okay, so select on it. Now it's telling us time to connect and set up and manage your printer. Select Continue. Now then, now it's access wi-fi for the following network so what you need to do is you select if you select continue it will try to connect this printer to wi-fi network but i usually like to select no thank you so that I, this will allow me to put the wi-fi password by myself so i'm going to select no thank you okay so now i give you option for you to put the password okay so we have to put the password sometimes people ask where do you get the password i have the wi-fi password for here this information you get it from the back of your broadband router the same wi-fi you use for your mobile android phone or whichever phone you are using is the same the, the same wi-fi details okay is what you are you're going to use so now i'm going to put the password okay When you put the password finished, then you select the I sign at the end for you to see. Okay, so select the I sign, okay, for you to see, double check if the information you put is correct. If And if, if the information is correct, then you, then you select connect. So what I'm doing now is checking the information to make sure that all the details are correct. Yeah, it's correct because if you miss any of the details, it will not connect, I'm afraid. Okay, so now, the next thing to do is we need to select connect select connect okay and now printer is found okay so the next is configuring the printer okay you can see a printer configured okay so now it's joining network Some printers it will ask you to press flashing information but in this case it's not asking that information but we're just gonna wait for it to join network and finish the connection but this now i can see it's telling us unable to connect the network to try again sometimes you may need to do this again unable to connect try again okay so we need to select the, okay choose the network so scroll down okay to select the correct network okay and put the password Okay, select connect. Okay. Printer is found. So we're joining the network. Sometimes you may need to do this a couple of times for this to work. And see network join and printer is connected to network. You can see. 
so this is to show you now this printer connected to Wi-Fi network let's continue our guide setup okay so select continue accept all okay connected printing service accept all now it's asking us about ink enrollment I'm going to skip this offer okay skip savings are you sure skip the offer if you want to select ink service then you go ahead okay now it's asking us printer adding the print printer okay so we need to add a code problem complete this step to add your printer so we need to select the pin number okay so open up the printer okay there, there is a pin number here we need to add okay make sure the printer is connected to internet locate and click and code near okay so this is the code here so we're going to put the code So the code you will see the printer pin is what is here okay so once you put the pin you select add you can also put the postcode where the printer is located okay click continue okay select auto update and select continue okay so setup complete now print from other device so you skip sending link now set up complete let's print select print okay select print and you can see the printer here hp digit 3700 series the document will printed maybe perhaps sometimes i have a lot of printers here so you need to make sure you select the correct printer otherwise it will not print select print document and you will see supported file document file type click ok now it will take you for you to print document you have from documents or anywhere you save the document you want to print out okay you scroll down to select the document okay so this is the document i want to print select this document and select print now this document now we are printing out is two pages okay so you can see page one to two this is the, sec the second page okay this is the second page one to two okay now to print this document out we need to select you decide if you want to print it in color or black and white okay so first of all you select the orientation you have option for landscape or portrait you select landscape and also you need to make sure you select the correct printer and the paper size is A4 and the next is paper type is plain paper output you select quality highest quality or normal then you select how many copies okay then you scroll down you see duplex printing if you want to print on on one side then you select print on one side if you want to print on both side okay with this printer you print on both sides but you need to turn the document the other way around okay so it will tell you how to print on both sides so i'm going to show you how to print on both sides okay then you scroll down and select page ranges if a document you have is more than 11 or more than two or four okay then you need to select page ranges so you select particular page pages you want to print you can select print current page or print pages in range you want to print pages in range maybe one to four then you select one to four okay but this document now is two pages so i'm going to print select print all, all pages and then select print now this document is going to is printing okay now to print the second page okay so to print the second page what you need to do is you need to put the document you want to print the other way around okay so put the document you want to print okay and select once it's gone in okay because once the document this document go go in you'll be able to print from the other side and select continue 
So you select continue. Okay, so this is the document we printed on both sides. You can see what it looks like. We printed this document on both sides. Okay, so you can actually print on both sides using your laptop. Printer now is set up. Okay, if you're happy with this tutorial, please do consider to subscribe. It helps the channel.